Uh, greetings, everyone. The majority of us have access to social media. Uh, it is affordable, particularly WhatsApp. It is affordable. Uh, you can make a call, what we refer to as a WhatsApp call, at low cost. Um, you can uh, chat at low cost compared to when you're making a normal call or when you're sending an SMS. So WhatsApp it has come in handy to assist us to improve our communication with our comrades, our friends, our brethren, and so on. So, but WhatsApp and social media in general, while it is good, it is also dangerous. We have people that are fond of sending voice notes. Uh, people will be too busy to type and they decide to send a voice note. Uh, but what you must know is that anything that you send on social media, uh, it is likely to trend. I'm sure I'm, I'm, I'm being clear. Any message that you send out on social media, it is likely to, to trend. So whatever you send out, you should send out a message that when it reaches uh, every one of us, not the intended person, you will not be embarrassed by the message. And also, if you are a receiver of the message, if a person sends you a message in confidence, a WhatsApp message in confidence, if you then want, if you then decide to share it with the second person who was not the intended person, it means you cannot keep your secret between yourself and the sender. And you cannot then expect the second person that you have sent it to, to keep it as a secret. The person will also circulate. So depending on what the message says, it might trend, it might not trend. Same with a voice note. You are too busy uh, to type, uh, you are too busy to make a call, but you find it easier to simply record a voice note and a send. Be careful on, on the messaging on what you send on voice note. Because what you send on voice note might end up trending and embarrasses you. So voice note, notes or social media has potential to destroy organizations. It has potential to destroy families. If, for instance, I send you a, a voice note message and it is only intended to you, or you, you send me a voice note, uh, it is intended for me only, I should be disciplined enough not to share that voice note with the next person. Because if I then share that voice note with the next person, the next person will also want to share with the next person. It end up trending. And that this has destroyed the families, it has destroyed the organizations, and it is destroying our society. Because you are talking to a person in confidence. You send a message, you are talking to me in confidence. Let, 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 let me just give you an example, right? You send me a voice note. Uh, uh, you then, in your voice note, you then mention your passport number. It's a private, right? Uh, and, and because you trust me, but I then send your voice note to someone else with all your details. That becomes problematic. So it is important that uh, when I record a voice note, whether I'm driving or whatever the circumstances, at the back of my mind, I should be able to say, what if 
my dear comrade or friend were to decide to pass it to someone, what will happen? Will I be comfortable if everyone listens to the message that I've recorded? Some of us, we do use voice notes in uh, political groups where we engage. And the intention is clear is that you want that voice note to circulate as far as wide as possible, right? You want it to trend. But if you do not want your voice note to trend, make sure that you send it to a trusted person who is not going to send to another trusted person. I have my trusted person or trusted comrade. You also have your own. Yes, so he's on here, on and so on and so on. And the chain becomes long. And the voice note end up trending. And once it trends, you can't stop it. So it's important that uh, we must be disciplined. If we are to build our society, if we should, if we are to ensure that our society is not destroyed by social media, you can't talk. You, you might be talking in confidence to me. You talk about another comrade in confidence to say, uh, comrade, yes, we suspect that this comrade uh, might be a plant, right? Uh, might be a plant and uh, these are the reasons you are sending me a voice note where you suspect that a particular comrade might be a plant and because I'm not disciplined enough I then share your voice note with the other comrade and say ah this comrade says he suspect that this comrade must be, might be a plant. What do you think? I send it to another comrade. And then the other comrade does the same. Until the voice note reaches the person that the comrade A was talking about. <clears throat> and then now it is not a, a comrade Mapena who circulated or who made a trend. Now the blame goes to the very person who recorded the voice note. And this comrade gets confronted. Oh, so you think I'm a plant. What makes you think I'm a plant? So social media destroys organizations because most of us are not disciplined in using social media. So like I'm saying, when you record a voice note, at the back of your mind, just, just, ima just imagine that this voice note might go beyond <laughs> the person I'm sending to because this comrade might actually send to another person and becomes problematic. So, it's advisable that some of the sensitive information that you know that if I record this and it gets to the ears of the unintended person, I'll be in a fix. Do not record the voice note. Rather, make an appointment. You meet the person face to face and have a discussion as opposed to circulating a voice note when it starts to circulate you can't recall it back so i thought it's important that uh, uh, while while we use social media uh, uh, to propagate our views um uh, for instance i want this video to trend because that's the intention of recording but when I speak to a comrade, say I speak to comrade Ian Bidos, when I do a voice note, I should trust that comrade Bidos 
will not send to another comrade. But if I think, ah, maybe comrade Peters might want to get the views of another comrade, I would rather make an appointment and we have tea together. We talk over this sensitive issue as opposed to recording a voice note. Please share your views. These are the tips for uh, social use of social media because uh, most of us, we are now we've <laughs> replaced <laughs> our traditional way of doing things, of meeting, having these discussions. We want to simple send out voice notes. And you think that once you send a voice note, I will keep it to myself. Please share your views in the comment section. I am Mabuto Nicholas Mapena. Like this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel, and please circulate. If you are on TikTok, please do follow us. Amanda.